So I just woke up and I found out I'm on the front page of Reddit and some people were wondering why there's a jump cut at a minute and 22 seconds. And it's because I was editing boring parts out. So in this video, I'm going to show you the whole clip unedited. It's pretty boring because I was trying to fit it back in there and I was trying to figure out what caused it. I mean, it was sitting there before I started filming and you can see it in the clip. So I want you guys to be able to see this unedited so you understand that I was, this was my actual reaction. I was shocked. I didn't know what to say. I was like, what the heck, man? And so when this happened, I was so focused on the filming. I was like, what? It just like threw me off big time. So here's the clip. Those plugs will not last a single winter storm. There is no way. If you're trying to use this as a permanent installation, it will not work. Oh my God. What is this? <laughs> I just had the plug come off. I didn't even try, or I mean, oh my God, the, the switch literally came off. Why did it fall off? I did not mean to do that. This was while filming, oh my God. <laughs> All right, guys. Oh my God. All right, so the switch actually falls off. I didn't even plan for this. This is while I was making this video. This switch just freaking fell off, really? Oh my God. This should not happen. This should be durable, okay? Okay, this switch just broke. <laughs> Come on. All right, guys, so the Energy Apex is breaking while I'm making this video right now. Oh my God, I can't put it back in there. I don't know why. So yeah, guys, the switch is gonna fail in under a week. What the heck, man? And I think Energy is trying to make a good product and they have nice people there trying to help people out, but this is just bad. You can't sell it like this. This is not, whoever's designing it, you guys need to find. And moving forward, I really want Energy to come out with a better unit. I hope that these videos, you know, inspire them to fix the problems because they're gonna be stuck with a lot of returned units. And even for me as a sponsor, I got this thing for free and I can't really use it. The switch is now broken. And also all the things I wanted to use it for. I wanted to use it with the automatic transfer switch for like a small house system. I can't do that. So what I'm stuck with is I need to pay shipping to get this back to them. And so it, it's a big bummer for everybody. So I hope that energy sees this as an opportunity to build a better system because the market does need it. And I've been telling them over and over specifically what they need to have and they're not giving it. Another thing I need to state is my comment about firing the engineers that they hired. In my mind, when I was making the video, I was thinking there's no way an engineer would let this pass through. There are too many problems, but I didn't think about, you know, the whole corporate landscape and how you have people up on top dictating things to the engineers. So yeah, I take back that comment and I'm not sure who's to blame. I just really hope energy learns and whoever is to blame fixes it. I want this to be fixed. The world needs solar power systems. We need off grid power. There are so many people in villages that need these systems and I'm tired of seeing cheap units going on the market. There are so many cheap Chinese ones that either fall apart or do not work as advertised. So I really hope, and energy has what it takes to make the product amazing. So I hope they watch these videos and fix it. I need you guys to build a better one. Please build a better product. Another thing I need to mention is everything that I stated as criticism is easily found in the manual. Some people want to hear more details about this. Please watch my 26 minute video. It's in 4k and it will explain every single point in great, great detail. Um Ah, oh. so I, <laughs> I hate making these videos, but this energy apex after testing it for a full week, I cannot recommend it to my viewers. It has too many problems and there is no way that you guys, it literally the switch broke off while making this video when I was doing the first take. It's too Jeep, it's too junky, whoops. And to be honest, if you guys saw like my initial first takes, most of it is just like me sitting there thinking 
thinking and then I sit up and I'm like and this is something to think about as well but yeah I usually film these in one take but I have tons of breaks so there's lots of jump cuts because I don't want to put you guys to sleep I am super boring if I did it in one take and did not edit it it would look horrible so yeah I hope this clears it all up if you guys have any more questions please ask them in the comment section below and I'll answer them ASAP so yeah I'll talk to you guys later bye